Uh, Stu Peters, some of the things that I hear these white supremacists say just disturbs me. These people, the first thing they want is violence. The very first thing they talk about is killing, shooting, whoever doesn't agree with them or is doing something they don't like. This guy's like, we need to shoot these people helping immigrants. What is wrong with a guy who says shit like that? You're, dude, you're mentally fucked up. Your, you, the, your human soul is like real, real, real tiny. And on your last day, you will suffer greatly. The most beautiful thing about the near-death experience is it's fair. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. It is information in perfection. Nothing, nothing will escape. Every, every, every action that you cause that harmed another, you'll suffer that harm because you'll choose to do so because you'll want God. In order to do that, you go through this cleaning process. It turns you into someone else. But the information is kept in perfection for other, other entities to experience. These guys will escape nothing. The ones who are full of hate, that's what they'll, they will experience that. And the, the, when you, when you're free of your physical body, you're something else. And I, I've never been able to describe that or even come close to describing that. I, it, it's impossible. Um, other near-death experiences have tried. And for me, I mean, they strike a, a chord. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I agree 100%. But you're something different there. The, everything that your the animal needs to survive, instinct, you name it, it's all gone. There's no animal any longer. It's that's why it's so beautiful. The animal's gone, and now you understand the 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 very depth of everything, all the harm that you caused. And you will gladly pay that price. So, I mean, like I've said, you could imagine people like Stalin and Hitler, how many times they died. And it's not, it's, it's the people you affected. So you'll also live the grief of the parents, of the brothers, of the sisters. See? There's no escaping this perfect information. And it's not going to take a million years. It's not, it's not a million year sentence. Time and space doesn't exist the way it does here. It's an instantaneous thing. You, you can live a million lives instantly. It's fair. It's the most incredibly awesome thing that God does. And even though you've chosen this path, you can change your direction anytime. You can always be a better person anytime you want to be. So when I read articles about this guy talking about killing people, shooting people at the border who are trying to get across, and I'm like, okay, so I, can, I know you're not an American Indian. I trace my ancestry back here thousands of years. They were scalping my relatives. They were, they were scalping the Wintu people, and I'm, I'm like, if, to wrap my head around that when I was a little kid was very hard. Because I thought that only happened in the Midwest and Texas. and No, it happened in California. And this guy is saying immigrants. The word immigrant coming out of his mouth is disgusting to me. Yeah. There's no escaping the truth. Trust me, they will all pay exactly the price. Exactly. Okay? Because they'll choose to do so. We all do. That's really, that, yeah, I'm ashamed of my fucking country when I hear people talking like that. It disgusts me.